everyone and welcome to your Saturday morning tip. Today we're going to be talking about stretching and how you get prepared to play to the best of your ability. If any of you have dogs or cats, like the wonderful Molly here, we all know that the first thing they do in the morning is stretch. And they do that for a reason, they have to get loose. And as golfers, you have to be able to do that too. So I'm going to give you a couple of simple exercises to help you loosen up that body of yours. And you know what, the older we get, we need to do more of this. So here we go, we're going to start with um, just a simple loosening of the hamstrings and glute here. So get a club just to support yourself with, and with the side that you're going to swing your leg, just swing your leg, kind of coming back and forth like this, okay? Feels really good. Got to stretch the hams and the hips, okay? If you stretch out your hamstrings and hip flexors, you can fire those glutes as Tiger Woods is famous for, and also get your hips engaged in the swing. They won't be doing that if they're not loosened up. So that's a really good exercise. Simple one as well, just touch your toes like this. Oh, and really feel that you know, stretch in your, your glute in the back of your hamstrings there. Down and through. And I like to go and do the side stretch, get your obliques and the, this from the rib cage up, all loosened up, pull down with the opposite side, back to here, like that too. Really good one. And then of course you can do as many as you like, but the more the better. Wrists are really important too. Get a club, just do this to open up the, the forearms there, the elbow, wrist joint, both hands. We do that back and forth like this. And then one of my favorites, people don't talk about grip pressure or um, you know how, how strong we hold on to the club, to make sure our fingers are into the game as well. So just feel that you're flicking out to the, the um, distance there like this. We'll look like this from the side, okay? So these are simple ones, but the, you know, anything to get your whole body activated and loosened up. One of my favorites here too is the windmill. Boom, boom, like this. Okay, you can really feel a nice little rocking with the hips back and forth. Bottom line, folks, you've got to get your hamstrings and your glutes and your hip flexors activated and ready to go when you're playing. It doesn't matter if you're 35 handicapper, scratch golfer, old or young, you've got to get your body loosened up. Is that right, Molly? She's going to be talking to you very soon with a little recap here. This one.